everybody, welcome to New York City and the world's most famous arena. Along with Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. They don't get a chance to connect too often. This is made for an intriguing matchup for you tonight. Yeah, it doesn't necessarily mean the game's going to be any better, but you get to play against different guys. The fans get to see different guys. It adds a little bit of air of, I don't know, expectation to the game. Enough talk, enough hype. Let's do this. Your first period is set to go. The Kraken have won the opening face-off and take possession here at the start. New York's got a hold of the puck now. Grabbed along the board by Natchez. He grabs the puck here at the point. Referee Shilovec's hand is in the air. We've got a penalty coming up. And play comes to an end as someone is heading to the sin bin. Kako's going off for interference. The officials will let a little bit of interference go. Not that much. That's a pretty easy call. Sending their power play unit out for the first time tonight. Scoreless game. Power play gets their first opportunity. Man, I couldn't get on the ice quick enough for these, James. Here's a short pass to Cajon. And that one's turned away. And now he tries to get it across to Suter. Scooped up along the wall by Manchapani. come from when he's shooting the puck when it's flat and settled on the ice. He has great accuracy, and we call that his snipe zone ability. And that shot gets caught in traffic. Heedle's got it along the boards. And puts the body into it, a little bumper car hockey. They get a trail on the rush. And that's blocked. Moves it quickly over to Natchez. Made the stop on that play. Here he is in front. Oh, and he just puts it wide of the net. Most dangerous place on the ice, and he can't capitalize. The Rangers will play it in their own end. Puck scooped up by Pasternak. Quick pass to Pierce. The shift continues. What great pressure. Knocked away in the offensive zone. Picked up along the wall by Pierce. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Shesterkin. No room for the shooter. The goaltender snuffed it out. Kubalik's recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. Pierce is known for scoring when he shoots while still in motion. His off-the-rush zone ability helps him get his shot off before the goalie can catch up to it. Fox's tape-to-tape -tape zone ability is when he sends firm, accurate passes to keep the play going for his club. Those are two players I know I'm going to be keeping an eye on tonight. Let's see if one of them can give their team the upper hand. Guys, back to you. Can't get a hold of that pass. And the linesman calls icing on the play. Pierces at the face-off dot, ready to win this draw on the man advantage. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. They'll be back on their heels. They lose the draw after they've iced the puck. They're a little tired. Moves it to Pierce. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Oh, and somehow he gets a sliver of it and keeps it at bay. Sometimes you make a good shot, you just get beaten by the goaltender. I'd say that's one that you put in that category. Comes up with a stop. Oh, there's one more. Blocked in traffic. What a stop. I like the way he tracks the puck here. He's got to find it, and then he gets his body right in front of it. That's a good save. Oh, he just got enough of that one to turn it aside. Kubalik's gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. Looking to clear the defensive zone. And they do just that. Oh, I thought they did a pretty good job there, James. That's a time you can get yourself right. He scores! Boys on the board. It's the first of a long season. You want to get to one as quick as you can. He 
doesn't get a clean look at this with the traffic in front of the net. He's trying to find the puck, and by the time he does, it's behind him. Seattle's up early. Impressed by the way they're playing so far. Really, I am. At, we talked to their coaches this morning, and they said, like every team, you want to start quickly, but this is about perfect. Hooked away in the neutral zone. The Kraken have gained control of the puck along the wall. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. And he's able to handle that one. Sandheim's been out with that injury, but it looks like he hasn't missed much. That's a good shot on goal. Takes the pass as he banks it off the wall. And now he angles it across to Pasternak. Moves it to Pierce. The Rangers have a hold of it in the defensive zone. And now he moves it to Strom. Here he is, wrists it on net. Oh, what a blocker stop on that. Oh, I thought he had the corner. He comes up just wide. Yeah, he's looking to put that right inside the post, but it's just a little wide of the target. Seattle's got the puck in the defensive end. Passes it over to Pierce. And he takes a shot, and the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. And the puck's kicked free. Manages to hang on. Driving right to the front. Quick feed to Pierce. And he makes the save. Shesterkin's gonna opt for the whistle and give everybody a chance to breathe. Sometimes you get running around as the shift gets long. This helps. Di Pietro's in good position to use the blocker there to shield that away. Seattle's got it in their own zone. They go on the attack through center. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Foley with a stop. He's sharp on that one. Nowhere to go for the puck. Lots of time left here in this frame. We got a one nothing game to this point. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Sends it over to Lafreniere. Slides it up ahead from the right wing. Here's a short pass to Lafreniere. Picked up by Morrissey. Seattle's team defense is something to watch tonight. I love the way that the they score! What a shot! That's a great sound when it pings off the post. You don't hear anything except you see the goal, Mike. What a shot. Playing like this isn't for the faint of heart. If you're going to lower your shoulder, you're going to get creamed once in a while. He doesn't seem to care as he drives it to the net and puts it in behind the goalie. zone. And that's some great pressure in the offensive end by the Frenier. Hangs onto the puck. Pasternak's got it in the defensive end. Feeds the puck to Pierce. From the left side, they enter the offensive zone. Into the corner. Turns him away. 
Shesterkin's going to hang on to that one for a whistle. Quickly on top of that, JT needed a cover there. Doesn't always have to look pretty. He stopped the chunk of the puck, and that chunk was just big enough to stay out of the net. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. We've got a 2-0 game here tonight. Quick pass across to Marcheseau. Slides the puck ahead to Anisimov. Denies him! Seattle's got the puck along the wall. Looking for space inside the D zone. Seattle's got the puck against the boards. And that goes off a player in front. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. And the puck's knocked loose. And that's a great hits up play by Marcheseau. Puck grab by Pinelli. Oh, wide of the net. You kick yourself in the tail after you miss a chance like this. Has to be on the net. Seattle's got the puck against the wall. Moves it quickly over to Pasternak. Play is blown dead. We've got a penalty on the way. Marcheseau is getting two for interference here. He's off to the box. If he makes the same play but keeps his feet rolling along, he's not going to get called for interference. It wasn't the case on this one, though. Jonathan Oli Marcheseau, two minutes for interference. On the penalty, 12 minutes, 55. Trying to get it out of their own end. And a big defensive play as they'll clear the zone on the penalty kill. No mistake there. That puck had to go down the ice. It's down off the glass. Pasternak's picking up momentum through center. Cuts into the paint. That's off a stick. The Kraken have possession along the boards. Move to the middle. Quick pass to Pierce. Rips it. Oh, the puck doesn't get there. So crowded in front of the goaltender. Trying to clear. Big win for the shorthanded unit as they clear the puck from the zone. That no one's going to keep it in the zone when it goes off the glass at that speed. Slides it up to Pierce. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Natchez. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Seattle's got control of it now from their own end. Moves it to Pierce. Great read with the stick. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. And a nasty whack after the whistle here. Yeah, he went after him pretty good there. That's a hard slap. Pierce is ready to go. Apparently, the other guy doesn't want anything to do with him. Kuokinen's ready for the draws that will continue to try to kill off this penalty. Pennelli's won the draw here in the offensive zone. Pierce's penalty has expired, and he'll join the penalty kill as they remain shorthanded. And that's stopped by Pietro. Quick feed to Fox. And he comes up with it. And no luck on that pass attempt. Back to the point it goes. Puck picked up by Marcheseau. Tremendous read and even greater sacrifice on the block. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Into the corner, he takes the pass. And that's knocked away. Into the attacking area from the left side. From in close. Ready to take the draw here on this power play. Clock ticking down here inside the first period. In the first period. Riley's got the puck in his own zone. Feeds it up ahead. Here he is in front. And that pass attempt is deflected. And there's the whistle as he elects to slow things down a little. A pretty good decision here with the play starting to break down in front of him. Seattle's got it in the offensive zone. Tremendous play for the team as he blocks it. That goes off a twig. Tries to get it to Ekblad. Nice pass. Sends the pass over. Pierce has got it in the offensive end. Centering pass, and that one's broken up. Maintains possession. Oh, 
devastating hit. I'm telling you, James, sometimes you think you've got more room and you have none. He ran out of track right there. Tries to slide. Uh oh, oh no dice. Burst. No dice, man. Not happening on the play. Puck scooped up by Pinelli. Gets it over to Sanheim. And there's the horn concluding period number one as both teams get on the board. Second period still to come. We'll take a quick pause and be right back with more action.
feet of ice. Period two is set to go. Well, after an intriguing opening period, here we go. Period number two, puck is dropped, and we are underway. Right in the slot. Blocked in traffic. Great pass save. But he came out and challenged a good save. Picked up along the boards by the Frenier. And reads the play perfectly and picks off the pass. And things starting to ramp up a little bit now on the ice with that play. Fox has got it in the defensive zone. Here's a short pass to Kako. New York's got the puck against the half wall. Here's a shot. Oh, he'd like to have that one back as it goes off the side. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Moves it quickly over to Pierce. Oh. Scores! The captain comes through! You've got to get rid of that puck in a hurry from that spot on the ice. You're in the high slot, you're open, but you know everybody's converging on you. That was a great example of how he was able to use his superstar ability on that play to help him score a goal. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. And now it's grabbed by Marcheseau. Seattle's got the puck. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Look at the Savardian spinorama. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Seattle's looking to break out of their own end. Here they come inside the neutral zone. Jabs the puck away. From his own end, he moves it up ahead. Look out, here they come on the attack. That's a textbook save by Di Pietro. Di Pietro's been sharp stopping the puck tonight. He's got a really good save percentage, and his team's done a good job at the offensive zone as well. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. Seattle's been the better team here over the last few minutes, increasing their lead to two. Riley's stick handling in his own zone. The Rangers get a hold of the puck in their own end. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. And that's broken up in the defensive zone by Morrissey. Quick pass to Pinelli. And that pass can't connect. opponent. The Rangers looking against the half wall. Quick feed to Pierce. Through center along the wing. Looking for the hat trick now. Denied by the goaltender. Chesterkin's able to angle that save over to the corner so there's no rebound. Puck grab by Kako. Oh, and a smart heads up play. He was totally locked in on that play. Absolutely wild. Big scores, and that's the hat-trick! To get it done on the road is a really special accomplishment. You're dealing with checkers, you're dealing with the line matchup, and it doesn't matter where you are, three is a great night. The goalie's not going to like this, mainly because that turnover right in front of him doesn't allow him to get set. He gets beat down low. second. They worked hard to push this lead from one to two. I like the way that they've been playing. Face off here in the neutral zone and we are back underway. Seattle's on the attack. And now it's over to Pasternak. Hammers the shot. Makes the save. Cool and calm under pressure. Trying to get back on the attack now. The Rangers gain control of the puck against the wall. Along 
on the side. Here they come through the neutral zone. Sends it in on the attack. Plays the puck up ahead. Pierce's hat trick's already in the pass, but I don't think he's finished for tonight. Denies him on the slapper. There's the whistle as things will slow down here for a moment. Always a good play if you're not sure what's going on. Freeze the puck. The game moves so fast now, you don't get a chance to walk into a slapper like this very often. But the goalie's better and makes the save. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame, Seattle's really controlled the pace of play these last few minutes, leading by two. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. Takes the puck at the point. And now it's grabbed by Kraftstall. Dumps it into the Ozone. Seattle's gained possession along the boards. Here's a short pass to Verona. Takes it to the front. Score! Yeah, it is, but I don't think it's going to count. The referee waves this off on the ice immediately. having a goal called back, but they'll just have to play on as the puck's about to drop. Locks them up on the draw as they take possession. The Rangers take it across the blue line. Throws it on goal. That's turned away with the pass by Di Pietro. Moves it quickly over to Natchez. Looking to make something happen along the boards. The Rangers have it against the wall. Quick pass to Kako. And that's picked off in front. Puck picked up by Pierce. Hugs the boards through the neutral zone. Handles the puck. And it's a quick pass to Murray. There's a hit on the play. Directs it on over to Strom. Moves it to Lafreniere. Moves the puck. In the defensive zone. Pass back to the point. Let's it go. Great stop by Di Pietro. Great shot from the slot. The Kraken has the puck against the boards. Murray's carrying it ahead. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Stopping the play. As we get another look at this stop, really good technique on the blocker getting that puck away from the net. Still lots of time left in the period. We've got ourselves a 4-2 hockey game. Quick feed to Pierce. Gains the zone through center. Oh! I think it's a chance for a breather here as he hangs on and covers the puck up. Who, for the players or for you? Well, you know, I won't be playing. Past the midway mark of the frame, 4-2 is the score. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. The Rangers move it in. The Kraken have taken possession along the wall. Down the right side and into the zone. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. Moves it around along the half wall. Marchessos lugging the puck. And now he tries to get it across to Pinelli. New York's got it along the wall. Quick feed to Anisimov. And that's broken up. Pasternak's got it into offensive territory. Here's a short pass to Anisimov. Puck scooped up by Pion. Centering pass, and that one's blocked. Takes a shot. Oh, and I'm sure they'd like a redo on that. Now lots of work and nothing for it as they don't get the puck on goal. Moves inside. Great use of the stick in the defensive end by Riley. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. Stops 
Hits him with the glove. And as he opts to freeze the puck, we get a whistle. Starting to look like a little bit of a fire drill in the zone, so this is a good play. The setters will glide into the dot. Nietzsche moves it into the attacking end. Moves it quickly over to Fowler. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. And a strong effort on that play. Here he is from the slot. Denies him again. He's right on it. Two consecutive saves. Tough ones at that. Chesterkin's a little bit fortunate there. He makes a terrific stop. But he just gets a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Past the midway mark of the frame, James and Ray with you tonight. It's 4-2. Here's a shot. Oh, what a stop. I think through traffic like that, you're just hoping the thing hits you. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Slides it back to the blue line. Oh, it stays out. He got a piece of that one. Doesn't look like much, but the defensemen are helped out by this puck being in the corner. to Pierce, and that doesn't exactly go tape to tape. They go on the attack from the left side. Handles it along the blue line, and puts it anywhere but the way he wanted it to go. Seattle's got a hold of the puck. From center, they get into the attacking area. Denies him with the save. Now a quick pass to Lafreniere. Oh, and down he goes on the ice. Oh, he thought there was room. Obviously, there was none. Feeds the puck to Kako. Now he takes it over the line. Moves it to Strom. And that's picked off. New York's got the puck. Slides the pass over to Kako. Pokes the puck away. Robertson's got it now deep inside his own end. Sends it over to Lafreniere. Shoots it. Too much traffic in the lane. Here's a shot. Misses a golden opportunity there. Di Pietro's on top of the puck, and that'll stop the play. Pretty conservative play here, James, as he covers it up to kill the play. Late goings of this period. Seattle's doubled up on them. It's now 4-2. And that's snapped away in the defensive end by Riley. All alone on the breakaway. Oh, what a save by the goaltender. Terrific play to get in all alone. The move and the shot looked good to me. But the goalie is right on it. What a stop. Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. Great reflex on display tonight on his part. Yeah, he hit him so hard, the people sitting right on the glass are going to sit up straight. They're scared, too. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Couldn't complete the pass. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Quick feed to Kako. Takes it into the slot. Gets a piece of it to keep it out. Number two is in the books. There's been no shortage of offense tonight. Third period just around the corner. Ray and I will be ready to bring all the action in moments.
Are you ready? I'm ready. Ray's ready. The players are ready. Let's go. Moment of truth for one team. Here we go. Third period is underway. Ray, with two periods in the books, what are your thoughts on the game to this point? Seattle's ahead in this high chance, high danger game. No use changing the way you're going to play now. Drives to the paint. Fantastic save. And that's broken up. Seattle's looking to break out. Beautiful 360 with the puck. Stops him cold. Shesterkin's going to cover it up and get a whistle. Even with the traffic starting to close in, he had to grab that when he did. DiPietro's able to recover, and he makes an unbelievable save here. That's a good chance. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. Seattle's been the better club as they hold a 4-2 lead at this point. Nietzsche wins it in the offensive zone. What a save! He'll probably feel that one tomorrow. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. Good read by the winger as the two setters tie up. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. The Kraken have gained control of the puck along the wall. Di Pietro's on top of that one for a whistle. Little bit of traffic starting to form around the net. Kako is able to get everything behind this hit. He really lays one on here. Nietzsche wins the draw on their own end. And he slides it quickly to Pierce. Rips it and rips it, and that carries off a stick. Ekblad's back in the play after getting a new stick at the bench. Lafreniere's got it across the line. Takes the feed at the point. Green hits that play with the stick by Pierce. Moves the puck over to Riley. Through pass ahead. Trying to engage a little physicality here. Ekblad's moving the puck through his own zone. Nice feed from the right wing. Great poke check on the reach. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. Slides it quickly to Stevenson. Slides the puck ahead into the neutral zone. Heedle's gonna play it against the half wall. Here's a short pass to Pierce. Streaking into the attacking zone for the right. And that's broken up. Slides the puck down low. Taken by Ferrari. Nice zone entry from the left. Tried to make a move and the puck hops away. Heedle's trying a little bit too much there. They're in the offensive zone. Just make a direct, simple, quick play. Probably better off than trying to do what he did there. Chesterkin's able to handle that scoring chance like it's nothing. He makes a stick save on it. Pierce is ready for the draw on this man advantage. Hedo's won it in their own end. Poked away in the offensive end. The Rangers move the puck in the defensive zone. Grabbed along the board by Hedo. More time off the clock as they grab the puck. New York's got it in their own zone. Scooped up along the wall by Pasternak. He got all of that hit. New York's moving it along the wing. Long reach breaks up the momentum. The Kraken have gained possession off the wall. Moves it quickly over to Pierce. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Now we'll get another look at this. 
That's a good shot, but the goalies get the blocker up to make the save. Lots of time left in this period. It's a two-goal lead here tonight. 4-2 is where we're sitting. Works it across to Marcheseau. Seattle's top line is one of those lines I just love to watch play. When they get it rolling, it seems like they're unstoppable. Shift after shift, they're the most dangerous players on the ice. Oh, and that goes awry. Man, they create the scoring chance, and it's a good one, but they don't get it on the net. And now he moves it quickly to Pinelli. Sends a pass over. The Rangers take it along the wall. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. Oh, that goes off the mask, and it stays out. Everybody hesitates for a half a second when they hear the puck hit the goaltender's mask. They all know what that one must feel like. And that's blocked away. The Rangers take it along the wing. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. Aaron pass, and they can't connect. The Rangers take it along the wall. On the attack along the boards. Puck grab by Natchez. Hemmed up along the boards. Great forecheck by Kako. New York's got it behind the net. And now he angles it across to Ekblad. Denies him! He got all of it! Goaltender covers up and will get a face-off. The Rangers have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Jumps it in. Seattle's got a hold of it along the wall. Moves it to Kubalik. Across the line from center. Takes the feed. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. And now it's grabbed by Riley. Inside the defensive zone, moving the puck. Taken by Morrissey. Quick feed to Stevenson. Picked up along the wall by Brown. You want to make this thing believable for yourself. You've got to get away from that two-goal deficit. They've done it here. And now they'll look for the tie goal. And the goalie's going to look at his teammates and say, is anybody going to cover the high slot? He was so open, he was able to hammer home the one-timer. The Rangers win it. Takes the pass. And now he moves it to Fox. And that one stopped. Scrum ensues along the boards. With possession along the wall. Picked up along the boards by Pasternak. Oh, what a save in front. Di Pietro surprised a lot of people over his career with some of the saves he makes. Now, this isn't the best one ever. Man, this is a beauty. It surprised me. I didn't think he was going to get it. Taken along the wall by Riley. Passes over to Pierce. Along the half wall with the puck. Here's a short pass to Strome. The Kraken have possession along the boards. Takes a buck, but still hangs on to the puck. standing by with who had the better night. Pierce is a great player when he gets engaged, and he has been that tonight for the offensive side of this game. I've been impressed with his performance. The Rangers win the draw. New York's got the puck in their own end. Every time you turn around, there's another goal. Your throat's got to be getting sore with all these goal calls. I love it. The more wild and unpredictable the game, the they score! They show no frustration as they try to crawl their way back in. One shot, one rebound, whatever it is. Now they're tied. New York's late third period goal certainly opens up a lot of decision making for the coaches, doesn't it? It does, but they must feel pretty good about their position because they just scored. I suspect they've got a little bit of a leg up, even though the game is tied. The Kraken have the puck in their own zone. Great defensive effort with the stick. And the puck's booted away. Referee's hand goes up in the air. We got a delayed penalty coming up here. Fox is out there on this power play, and you know he'll be looking to use his zone ability to help the team score here, guys. Let's see how things play out. And the penalty killers will get a well-deserved break here as they kill off the man advantage. 
Wow, that seems like a big miss, James. Critical moment in the game, and the power play laid flat for them. DiPietro is going to smother it to get a whistle. Can get dangerous if nobody's in control of the puck. Here in the late goings of the period, we are all tied up in this one. One minute left. Regulation time comes to an end. That means we've got some overtime coming up. Don't forget, fans, if you're here with somebody celebrating a birthday tonight, go to our guest services booth and you'll see them. away from puck drop. New York's won the draw. They'll go to work. Off the glove. Puck scooped up by the Frenier. Moves right to the middle. That's kicked away with the pad by Di Pietro. Seattle's in transition. Broken up in the neutral zone by Strom. New York's got the puck along the wall. Made that stop. Here's a shot. Oh, what an effort giving up the body there. The Rangers get a hold of the puck along the boards. With the stop. DiPietro's on top. Oh, the face wash here. James, it's not even a face wash because your face isn't clean after he drags his glove across your face. Pierce is looking around for somebody to fight. He's going to have to go and fill the dance card somewhere else. Anisimov is known for being able to generate offense with his zone ability. And guys, there's no better time than overtime to come up big. Let's see how he does here. Sends one up to Pierce. Here's a chance. Turned aside with the glove by Shesterkin. Zone ability that helps him create scoring chances, guys. Let's see if it helps him end it here for his club. Pierce has won the draw. The lane was plugged up and that shot's blocked. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. New York's in now. Slides it across. Stones him in front. Di Pietro's gonna slow things down and up for the whistle. Well, you gotta kill the play eventually. That way everyone can get reorganized. draw here in the offensive zone. Oh, that's a huge stop by Di Pietro. There's another stop. Oh, he reads the play really well to get out and aggressive to make that save. Pasternak swooping in on the attack. Looking to end it. Oh, we are still tied. What a stop. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Receives the pass. Nice zone entry from the middle. Quick pass to Fox. Off the crossbar. My goodness, what a shot. New York still tied in this game, yet they've had no luck. Another post. Steps inside the line. Levels him with the hit. Seattle's working the transition through the middle of the ice. Dishes it to Pinelli. Puck grabbed by Atlant. Skates to the crease. Looking to end it. Seattle's got a hold of the 
puck now. Here they come. New York's got control of it now from their own end. Takes the feet of the back end. The Rangers will play.